All right. Oh, uh, summation. Yeah, you want to do this problem, Matt? Go ahead. What we got here? So it looks like, uh, well, wait. We didn't we do this yesterday? Yeah, yeah, I think it was yesterday. So we should be able to get some help from this, I think, from the class. Yeah, I think so. Okay. So um, can anybody help us start this problem? Oh, sorry. <laughs> Tell me who. Anybody. Oh, over here. Anything by using that. Oh, sure well, one of the nice things is that occasionally we, we, we can do that. And so um, if you really want to see, we'd love for you to come to our other session <laughs> where Adam will take a little bit of a break and I'll talk a little more <laughs> in the next session. And um, we're going to move a wall just like this student right here. 1215, 115, B2, and we'll show you how to do it at that time. Yeah. Solid wall, when you push on it, does it actually move? Do students think it moves? If it does, can you actually calculate how far it moved using a cool little setup published in Mathematics Teacher about six months ago? So come, 1215, it's going to be fun.